is Ms. Kingswell at the end of the sofa and Pavacini at the left end. We did. That's part of it. So try and think sometimes. You went to your Wanda, bedroom. Uh, uh, again, uh, Christopher, uh, sometime. Now you have to do them over that word, sometime. That's, uh, do that again. Top 36. I, think I mean, good. one does want to be alone sometimes. You went to your bedroom because you wanted to be alone? And I wanted to brush my hair and uh, tidy up. You wanted to brush your hair? Anyway, that's where I was. Curious that you and Mr. Ralston didn't meet on the stairs. Well, I might have been apprehensive. I believe on the first day, uh, as we walked down the hall in new school, uh, students who had not had uh, Negro teachers before, I, I felt perhaps somewhat apprehensive. But after I had a chance to really, uh, what shall I say, um, uh, get to know the situation and work with the students, uh, it was as easy as breezing. You said there was some apprehension at first, but this changed after Mr. Kennedy was here a while. What brought the change about? Well, I guess it's because we got to know Mr. Kennedy. And first quarter I had Mr. Norman, it was the same with him, that we began to know the, the teacher as a person. And you can't just lump everybody and say they're bad or they're good or they don't care about anybody. Because I've had some white teachers who were the same way, that they didn't care. And I've had others that cared a great deal about each student and tried to help each one. And I believe it's the same way with the Negro teacher. It doesn't make any difference what race the teacher is. It's what's inside, whether he cares about the student or not. And a student can tell this, and tell if the teacher really is concerned. How do the students treat you? What do you say to the black teacher who's worried about going into a white school? Well, I would tell them not to be. I would tell them that the, the major concern uh, uh, that they'll be looking uh, forward to would be what they have to offer. And if the quality of the education is good, and you have a real concern for uh, students, these two things would be the major factors. I believe there has been something learned because without him coming and breaking the ice, there wouldn't have been any, any kind of initial, you know, standing there to where we would have been subjugated to it. And when Mr. Kennedy did come, he, he showed the students for the most part that there was no great barrier between the races as far as the learning, the learning processes or anything like this. In fact, uh, the story that I like so much here at Sylvan is uh, one day a student um, asked another student uh, what was my reaction to something that happened. I, I, at the time I forgot what it was. The uh, student said, did his face turn red? <laughs> Uh, this would be an indication of, that they have forgotten color. And I think they only see me as their teacher. <laughs>